Howdy doody everybody, my name is Kev Gooey and welcome back to the Copper 3R. If you missed the last episode, you can click on the eye on top of the videos, watch the previous episodes, get caught up. For a moment, the girl just looked at me like she didn't understand what had happened, but... <laughs> Wrong. <laughs> when she realized I had cushioned her fall, she jumped back with a bright red face. It's dangerous if you don't use a taller stepladder. Also, you should have someone holding the ladder when you're using one. <laughs> so what were you doing? Cleaning the lights or something? <laughs> oh. The girl said pulling out small, pretty gemstones from her pocket and showing them to me. There was no mistake. These gemstones were imbued with some kind of magic. <laughs> Oh. Oh. You shouldn't make promises on a whim. For now, let me see those gemstones. I'll put them in for you. Don't worry, I'll finish in no time. Won't take but a second. Wow. I really did finish the work quickly. Girl bowed her thanks. A guilty look on her face. No, no, it really was nothing. Aww. I thought that was only normal. Yeah. By the way, what's your name? Judging from her look, she wasn't a student at the Magic Academy. Oh, Hinomoto-san? So she was Japanese. Yep. Yeah, I hadn't introduced myself yet, had I? My name is Katsuragi Kiyotaka. Starting tomorrow, I'll be a new student at the Royal London Aca uh, Magic Academy. Yay! The girl named him Hinomoto Aoi grabbed my hand before I could even finish speaking. Her smile was as bright as the sun and it left me feeling kind of pleasant myself. Faint blush tinted her cheeks. She must be quite happy to see another person from her home country. Uh, <laughs> oh, just like the other parallel universe where where Aoi wants a big brother. Huh. Ah. Huh? Mine froze for a moment. What was this girl saying? Uh um uh Hinomoto san was it? Aoi de i desu. Ah, but Aoi de onegaishimasu. Aoi san. <laughs> Is this so soon? Oh. Then Aoi chan. <laughs> what do you mean by be your big brother? Put her hands in her mouth and blush red as she realized the meaning of what she just asked. Kiyotaka's fine. Ben and I were both Katsuragi, and I'll probably introduce her at some point anyway. <gasps> the girl quickly tried to bow and make things better. Oh, it's fine, it's fine. I was just surprised by how sudden it was. But asking me to be her big brother? What would you want me to do? Oh, interesting. Oh, 
Wow, she's really asking a lot. I don't really mind that, but... This girl probably came here to this faraway foreign country all by herself. Maybe it's only natural she'd think of someone from the same country as an older brother figure. You're a big brother, huh? Eh. Uh, started recalling the day long ago when I became one little girl's big brother. Ah, uh, Himeno. But the voice break <laughs> but the voice breaking up my recollection was Himeno. Oh, I guess we won't be seeing that. I turn around and see my little sister standing there with a the demon's face. No, that's not what it is. No, no, no. Don't give me that scary, scary look. That's not what happened. Aoi-chan <laughs> curiously considered both of us. Oh, well, aoi this is Katsuragi Himeno. She came with me from Japan. She's my little sister. Meno said, putting extra stress on the fact that she was my little sister. Meno, irritation is showing for everyone to see. But I guess Aoi chan was oblivious. Either that or she just didn't care. Uh, uh, this is Hinomoto Aoi chan. Speaking of which, I hadn't managed to ask her why she was here yet. Oh. Work here? At the residence halls? But you were just changing out the residence halls lights, weren't you? Wow, she really likes to keep herself busy. I see. So she has lots of jobs around here. Looks like she's living in the United Kingdom all on her own, but why? Well, I guess it wouldn't be right to pry too much the first time we meet. Aww. Yeah, nice to meet you. <laughs> Are you trying to give us a bashful, carefree smile? Yeah. Meadow looked guilty. She was probably feeling bad about being so unfriendly toward a girl she just met. I think she wants to leave for now. She has to refine her social skills in those areas during her life here at the academy. Especially since I grew up sheltered, won't cut it in the future. That's... That's a... Uh, grew up sheltered? Oh. Oh, we just arrived here today, so we thought we'd go for a walk around the area to get an idea of the layout, or such. Ooh, a tour! Aww. I think Himeno's a little jealous. Shall we do? And yet, Himeno didn't sound very happy about it. Hmm, but I would feel bad about making you show us around. Alright. Uh huh. She's fine with it. Well, if it's not a problem with Himeno, then I couldn't ask for more, but. Alright then, Aoi chan, lead the way! Hooray! Oh my gosh, it's so pretty! Look at it! We just took this road, yeah. Uh-huh. 
This is. Where is this? Oh my gosh, Resort Island! I want to go there! Can we go there? I want to go there! Resort Island! The library isn't at the school, it's on an island. Huh. Meaning the knowledge I'm looking for is probably there on Library Island? Let's go there. Well, I mean, I'm pretty sure if, if you're surrounded by, like, you know, the ocean, it, I'm pretty sure there's a beach somewhere. Huh? Ooh. Oh, wait, she's been, like, homeschooled the whole time and everything, apparently, I think. If I recall correctly. Oh, yeah, she is sheltered. Yeah. Man and I both not in amazement. By the way, how do you get from one island to another? Ooh, a boat, huh? Yes, there's no point trying until I get in my boat. Oh well, no rush. I have plenty of time after all. Oh my gosh, this tour is awesome! Is this where you work? Right. She's so proud of it. Look at her. Cake before flowers? Hi. Cake before flowers? I guess it's the equivalent of food before romance or dumplings before flowers back in Japan. Wait, what? Dumplings before flowers? So if I'm in Japan I, and I want to I wanna woo a girl. I had to give the, them dumplings before flowers? I guess? Is that how that works? It's a pretty, pretty blunt name for a place serving food and drink. Oh, it's making me hungry. Aricha nodded happily. Maybe we'll try it sometime. Alright, there's more places to go. Oh, I mean, we were just here. Oh, um, the, the text kind of, um, went off screen, or I mean, went off the little border. Oh. Oh. Arichan spewed off all kinds of details about Weather Vane. You sure know a lot about it. Yes? Yeah. That's okie dokie. No, that's fine, right? Explodey! We'll learn the rest as we go, so it's fine. Thank you, Aoi-chan. Weariness of Aoi-chan was gone. 
Maybe it's just easy to get acquainted when we're all Japanese. What? Our chan's legs froze as she noticed something. <gasps> what is it? We'll find out in the next episode of Decapo 3R what she noticed because she is spooked. I hope you guys enjoyed the tour of the Magical Academy in London. If you guys did, then please slime that like button and subscribe down below for more awesome videos. Thank you everybody for watching this episode and you will hear me in the next one. Bye!